All right, welcome back. We are doing Assassin's Creed Bundle. Very nice, very cool. I really like Assassin's Creed. I know I grew up playing Assassin's Creed video games with Ezio. Brotherhood, I think, was one of my favorites, actually. All right, very cool. Let's take a look at the outside first. Very cool. It's really the reason you get these is just because it's super cool looking. You can store your cards in it, and it's a really cool looking box for storing your extra cards. Very cool. Got some cool stuff there. Alrighty, now, what you really came for is this stuff. So let's see. Oh, that's weird. Usually there's like a smaller box inside. So this is... Uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, this is a spin down. The number 20 is the set symbol, which is just the Assassin's Creed logo symbol. All right, so very cool. It's just black and red. Very plain. All right, so let's see. Bundle promo. Let's put this aside for now. There should be nine of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of these seven card packs, which I think supposedly you can get up to four mythics. That would be like a god pack. It's like almost impossible to get four mythics, but it is possible. Royal Assassin is the bundle. So for the giveaway, you're going to get this as well as the best pull out of my nine packs. So you got two planes, or oh, four planes, two of each of the full arts. Very cool. All right, and Swamp. So here's a look at all of the full art lands. And Forest. Very nice. So then the other pack should just be non-foils, right? We'll just fan through that. Yeah, it's just non-foils of all the same lands. And then there's a couple random things there. All right, so pretty cool. If you like Assassin's Creed, these lands are really cool. So let's get into these packs. Very thin. Don't want to damage the cards. All right. So there are no commons in this set. Smoke Bomb, Become Anonymous, Ottawale, Got a Mountain, Mythic, Light of Sword and Shadow. Very nice. That's really nice to get out of one of this type of pack. Reconstructed History for the Foil. And a character that I'm not familiar with. It must be from one of the newer games. I know they have a bunch of games that were like digital download only that were really short. They were just like 20 or $30. They weren't like full-on releases, full-on, you know, AAA style releases. All right, Phantom Blade, Alexios, Arbaz, got a nice island. Mary Reed and Anne Bonny, that's the rare. Layla Hassan and Senu. Nice, that's a showcase rare. Not a bad pack. I don't think there were any mythics, right? It was just rares. I think that pack had three rares in it. So that was actually pretty good for one of this type of pack. These, what are they called? Beyond Boosters. So with these sets that are just universes beyond, it seems like they're going to be doing these now. Bleeding Effect, Terminate. We've got Desmond Miles, very cool. Hidden Blade, Foil. Alexios, very cool. Uncommon Version. Desmond Miles is the, like the current time character. All right, next pack, Assassin Initiate, Adrestia. All right, Hunter's Bow, got a Plains. Leonardo da Vinci, very cool. That is a mythic. Very cool, big character in the Ezio trilogy. 
Terminate for the foil and Roshan foil showcase uncommon. All right, so I think that Sword of Light and Shadow is probably still our best card. That was weird. Wait at that open. All right, Hook Blade. Very cool. Go for the throat. Ezio Brash Novice. We've got Cassandra, another mythic. Very nice. Ezio again in foil that time and an uncommon Arno. Oh, and a art card. Very cool. I guess you can get art cards in these Beyond Boosters. So I guess this is just a fewer card variant of the Play Boosters. So apparently you can get art cards in these. As well as just filler cards like that one. All right, Hidden Foot Blade. I don't recall that in any of the Assassin's Creeds that I played. All right, Bayek, very nice. Restart sequence, we've got our Boz. All right, so Bayek was kind of cool for that pack, but that was like the only thing that was cool. The the and magic together. All right. Escape detection, monastery raid, reconnaissance. We've got Cleopatra. We're getting a lot of mythics. Is this above normal? We've gotten four mythics out of nine packs. All right. Reconnaissance, Ottawale, uncommon. And then, oh, interesting. For a. Not even a token. What is this? Just like a informational card. Oh, we've got an art card in this one. All right. Chain Assassination. Very cool. Hunter's Bow. Arno. Silent Clearing. Very cool. We got a Silent Clearing. It's a, they're, they're calling these scene cards, right? We got that instead of our land. That is just a rare, so I guess I won't put it up there. Jacob Fry. Very nice. Basim. Or Basim. How do you say it? I played that game, but I don't remember. That is Cassandra, right? Yes. All right, so Silent Clearing. That was cool. All right, last pack. Distract the guards, Mortify, Lydia Fry, We've got a Swamp, Aya of Alexandria, Hook Blade and Foil, ooh, Staff of Eden, very cool, very cool. All right, so I'll tell you what, I don't have TCG Player in front of me right now, so how about you guys tell me which card do you want? So, the giveaway, all you have to do is comment down below. Just leave a comment, anything at all. And in a few days, about six days, I will use an online random YouTube comment picker. That is how I choose the winner. So you can just comment literally anything. All right, so, I mean, off the top of my head, I'm pretty sure the sort of Light and Shadows is probably the best card, but the giveaway is going to be for the bundle promo card as well as whatever the top card in the set is, or the top card of the, the bundle that we pulled. The top pull of the video, let's say that. All right, so make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.